Adam's Surname Meaning and History, presented by COADB.com, where you can obtain affordable genealogy research. Surname Meaning It is an English patronymic surname, meaning the son of Adam, with Adam being a masculine given name derived from the first man mentioned in the Hebrew Bible. It is derived from the noun Adama, meaning soil or earth, and the name is common in England, particularly in South Midlands, as well as in Wales. Early bears included John, son of Adam, and Hugh, son of Adam, in Oxfordshire, England in 1273, German Adam in Cambridgeshire in 1273, Juliana Adams in Huntingdonshire in 1273, Alinor Adam in Cheshire in 1281, William Adams of Worcestershire in 1327, and John Adam was documented in Yorkshire, England in 1379. Noble titles held included the Adams Baronetcy of London, a title in the Baronetage of England created in 1660 for Sir Thomas Adams, who we see here. He was a draper by trade and became Sheriff, Alderman, Member of Parliament, and Lord Mayor of London and the baronetcy is assumed to have went extinct upon the death of the sixth baronet, Sir Thomas Adams, who was an officer in the Royal Navy and saw action in the Seven Years' War in 1770. And here we see two of the family's estates, as well as a list of the baronets all the way through the sixth baronet, who we mentioned. They also held the Adam Baronetcy of Blair Adam in the county of Kinross. It was a title created in 1882 for Sir Charles Adam, who was later the Lord Lieutenant of Kinrossshire, and the title was in honor of his late father, the liberal politician and colonial administrator, William Patrick Adam, who we see here. He was son of Admiral Charles Adam, who was son of William Blair Adam, a Whig lawyer and a descendant of William Adam, born 1689, of Edinburgh, and Blair Crambeth, an architect and a building contractor. And here we see Blair Adam House, family estate. The Adam Baronetcy of Hanklow Court in the county of Cheshire was created in 1917 for Sir Frank Adam, seen here, a British banker who made a fortune in India, and his eldest son, Ronald, seen here, born 1885, was the second baronet, and he was a general in the British Army. And here we see the family estate of Hanklow Court. Landed gentry families included Adams of Ansey Hall in Warwickshire, England. They were represented by George Curtis Adams in the 19th century, and they descended from Simon Adam, a merchant who was active in London, and he died in 1488. His descendant, Simon Adams, was Lord of the Manor of Great Packingham in Essex, and he left a grandson who became possessed of Morton Pinckney in Northampton. Adams of Bowden in County Devonshire, England. They descended from Henry Adams, born around the year 1642. And here we see Old House, one of the other family estates. One member of this family was William Adams, born in 1775. He was the elder son of William Adams. And here we see his son, Mayo Winel Adams, born 1809, of Old House. And he was Justice of the Peace for London and Kent. Adams of Holy Land in, I'm not sure where, oh, in Pembrokeshire, Wales. They descended from John Adams of Buckspool in Pembroke, who died in the year 1422. And they also owned another home, a tower home, it looks like here, called Patter Church Tower. Adams of Shercock House, which we weren't able to find a picture of, but they also owned Shinen House in Cavan in Ireland. 
And they descended from James Adams of Quora Neary House, who was born in the year 1673. Two members of this family were Charles James Adams, born 1792, a Royal Navy officer who saw action in the Mediterranean, and Rear Admiral John Adams, who was born in 1793. Adams of Northlands in County Cabin, represented by Ambrose Going Adams in the 19th century, and they descended from the Reverend Benjamin Adams, who was the fifth son of Alan Adams of Coroneri. One member of this family was Reverend Samuel Adams, born 1758. He was Dean of Cashel and Justice of the Peace for two counties in Ireland. Adams of Clifton Grange and Cotswold Grange, represented by Francis Adams, Esquire, in the 19th century. And lastly, Adams of Jamesbrook, represented in the 19th century by William Richard Wallace Gould Adams. Notables include Hannah Adams, born 1755, an American author of books on comparative religion and the early United States history. Samuel Adams, born 1722, an American statesman, political philosopher, and founding father of the United States. John Adams, American statesman, attorney, diplomat, writer, founding father, and second president of the United States. He figure behind the American Revolution. John Quincy Adams, sixth president of the United States. Sir William Adams, born 1783, an English surgeon. William Adams, born 1706, fellow and master of Pembroke College at Oxford. John Couch, Couch Adams, born 1819, a British mathematician and astronomer. Robert Adams, born 1791, an Irish surgeon who was president of the Royal College of Surgeons in Ireland. Henry Adams, born 1713, a British master shipbuilder who was responsible for building many famous warships during the 18th and early 19th centuries. Major General Sir John Worthington Adams, born 1764, a senior army in the British, uh, a senior officer in the British Army who served in India. And lastly, Edward Hamlin Adams, born 1777, a British merchant and member of Parliament. Early settlers to the United States included Robert Adams, who came aboard the Bonaventure in 1618. John Adams became, came aboard the Fortune in 1621. Andrew and Dorothy Adams came in 1635. John Adams came in 1635. Rachel Adams came aboard the Alice in 1635. And Richard Adams came aboard the Globe in 1635. And William Adams arrived aboard the Elizabeth and Anne in 1635. And if you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com where we offer affordable genealogy research. Link in the description. Thank you very much.